What's up, party animals? My name is Kezi, and today I am not in my full suit right now because this is getting a makeover. I've got a special new set of eyes, I've got new teeth, and I've got new foam and some stuff for the eyelids. So I will be doing some reworking of my fursuit, and that means uh, this is the last time you'll see my fursuit looking mostly like this. It should look pretty much the same, but with, of course, new teeth, these are gonna go bye-bye, and my eyes are gonna be replaced because they look trashed. So hang out with me while I show you the process of refurbishing my fursuit. Oh, if you look closely, you can see how bad it is now. Here, this whole thing is just delaminated. Over here, you can see the break as well. And like the, it's just picking up so much dirt too. As a replacement, I have these, which don't have the black pupils, but that should be fine. I think the super pink eyes would be super cute. They're like perfect size. Then I even have a few extras for like back here. I can do something like this instead. But step one is to remove the eyes, so let's go. Yeah, I look like an old man without the dentures. Look at that, wow. Man, that is gonna look different. Horrifying. <laughs> Just my fursuit without eyes. What the fuck? Can you get like just a lot of paper towels? Still blue. Dude, it, the back exploded. Yeah. So, I have new eyes, and they're pink, and bright, and vivid, and they look at you. <laughs> so, with all this new shiny stuff, um, I wanted to talk about how it happened, why it happened, and why you should do it. So, why did I do it? Well, um, my old eyes were falling apart, literally literally falling apart. The, the, the mesh was falling out. It was actually delaminated from the rest of the eye. Um, the eyes were made from a softer material and those are breaking apart. 
and my teeth were like blackened. <laughs> so it looked horrible. And this probably looks a little vivid, but I think it looks so good. For one, the teeth were a perfect fit and they look super cute. Um, and then I also have new snaggle teeth on the sides uh, that look so much better than my fangs I had. Uh, I don't even know where I made them. They just appeared on my first suit one day. But now I have like real teeth and really bright eyes. Um, the only thing I'm kind of weirded out about is I have no real pupils. It's just pink. I'm blinded pink. I look like I have that, like, uh, like that blind, I, I, I look like I'm blind because it's got that, like, fade over it. But that's totally fine. I can't see very well in fursuit anyway. So this works out. But the suit was falling apart. And I really don't have money, like, at all. Please support me on my Patreon. Um, but I got back from Anthro Northwest and was able to get, uh, Spilt Grapes Soda. Uh, she had her own room. This wasn't even in the dealer's den. It was a whole room dedicated to her and her fursuit parts. And man, I wish I got video of it because that room was awesome. It, it was basically like a subway for making your own fursuit. It had everything you needed. Teeth, hand paws, feet paws, tails, eye blanks, teeth blanks, eye mesh. So this really was a one-stop shop to get everything I needed to fix Kezi up. And the biggest thing they recommended was replace your teeth and eyes. If you have a new set of eyes and a new set of teeth, my goodness, you can be shiny again. And um, I brushed it. Get a slicker brush. I have been fursuiting for five years and I never owned a slicker brush. And you really need to. Now, I wouldn't recommend brushing it every single day with a slicker brush because it pulls out a lot of fur. So I use a slicker brush and a pet comb, both by Andis, which I highly recommend because they're uh, for animals. <laughs> so both of those together though, um, when I got the slicker brush, a lot of my fursuit started looking better. Like, even on my face fur, it was kind of starting to look matted. Now, it's super smooth. So, I'm in love with how good it looks now. And, impressed it got better. I didn't think this was salvageable after two years of tossing it around music festivals in the desert. How do you guys think about my fursuit? Do you guys have a fursuit you want to modify? Uh, tell me in the comments. Uh, like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. So I got a new fursuit and I recommend anyone who has their old tattered fursuit, play with it. There's no harm in trying to make your fursuit better because it is a craft project and anything you undo, you can typically redo.